Uh, sorry about the delay, everyone. I um, I didn't chew my coffee well enough. Kind of choked on it going down. It's actually even more embarrassing than that. Um, I took a sip of the coffee and then I decided to make funny like mouth noises with it. Um, and then it just went straight down my windpipe. <clears throat> so that's, uh, that's why it took me a little bit to start the sound check. <laughs> truly, truly an inspirational leader. Your future console. Absolutely. Anyways. <clears throat> Audio's looking decent, so let's, uh... Let's go ahead and uh, just stumble into this hyena den, shall we? Awate Amiki! My name is Faustus Marius Incatatus, the true consul of Rome, the favorite horse of the god Emperor Caligula. Thank you all so much for joining me on this uh, on this Tuesday evening. And, uh, well, if you look to my right, your left, you see that I am not alone. We are not alone. There is uh, always a hyena watching. Yes. Hyena! You can talk now. I you know. <laughs> you can talk while I get the uh, the game display to work. There it is. Okay. Yes. So, uh, yes. You're a silly pony. Uh, yes. Correct. <coughs> yeah, the really embarrassing thing is I think Yini, um... <laughs> I think Yini went to go make a drink herself. So she came back, and I think she caught, like, the end of the uh, embarrassing mouth noises and then the choking. I was like, what oh, she I returned to. Oh, I absolutely heard the mouth noises. You heard the mouth noises? Wonderful. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, I probably should have muted. Probably should have muted for that. Um. Hmm. I mean, to be fair, I thought it was soup you were having. Yeah, okay. Yeah, like, I, I could see that. I could see that. I was kind of just like rolling the coffee around on my tongue and uh, yeah, I had to do some suction so that it did not, uh, you know, fall out of my face. But uh, yeah. Yeah. Hope your, uh, hope your evening is... You don't have yeah. It's true. Well, I hope your evening is going better than mine, uh, Yini. How you doing? Pretty good. Yeah, pretty good. Having, um... Just having a little bit of beer and uh, some cold fries. It's beer and cold fries. Sounds pretty good. It's board game, it's board game food. Yeah, absolutely. What uh, what kind of beer are you having tonight? <coughs> I'm having some vice beer. Some vice beer. Wonderful. Hmm. Kind of making me want to get an alcoholic drink here. <clears throat> given the uh, disaster I, uh, well, given the disaster I had with my coffee, I'm not sure it would be uh, wise to uh, to graduate to alcohol at this particular juncture. But you know, yeah. maybe later. Maybe later. You'd need, you'd need a wise beer. <laughs> yeah, a wise beer. Yeah, I'm having some white plum moonshine. That sounds that sounds pretty darn good, actually. Hi, Ari Z. Hi, Wolfie. Good to see you. So, yeah. We're having a board game night tonight. Uh, me and Yini, we're going to be playing Talisman, which I've played yeah. before on this uh, on this channel. But, yeah, Yini, you, you probably are better ex at explaining it than I am. So, what the hell is Talisman? Yes. Uh, firstly, hello, RC, and... Uh, uh, good night, Die Wolfe. Die Wolfe. Uh, so, yes, so Talisman is a um, is a board game, to put it simply. That's that's the simple solution. Mm -hmm. It's it's from an era past, when when you had all of the really big board games. Yeah. And it just it came and it was wonderful. Um, <laughs> sort of the same era where you would play stuff like Hero Quest or Warhammer Quest, stuff like mm -hmm. that, like proper. Um, board games, but also with like a lot of stuff added, and it got more stuff added, more stuff added in form of expansions, both to the board, <laughs> but also to characters and add adventure stuff. And it it's massive. So the goal 
um, in the base game is that you want to travel around the board, defeating monsters, powering up, and getting gear. And eventually, you'll want to get a the eponymous talisman. Mm -hmm. Because the talisman will let you gain access into the deepest parts of the board uh, where the crown of command is. Mm -hmm. And if you get to the crown of command, you are more likely to win the game. There are two different rules that you can play within the base game. Either just when you get to the crown of command, you win. Mm -hmm. Or when you get to the crown of command, you have to like do stuff and then you win. Usually involves killing the other players. Right. Sorry, the other player characters. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tabletop Witcher, kind of. Yeah, that's a pretty good way to put it. Yeah. You are uh, you yeah. are definitely uh, rewarded for killing monsters and stuff. So that's yeah. how you get strong. The yeah the the thing that makes um, talisman uh, very replayable is that you have. Like, there, there are a couple different rules that you can go with, but also there are like a multitude of different characters. So you're, you're not just lock, locked into your, your standard warrior, your standard ranger, your standard caster. There are like, I think it's 40 or 50 different characters in the base game, something like that. Maybe it's only 30, but like still like a different selection. So you can, you can get some random characters uh, each time. And then, of course, all of the different expansions have additional characters added. So I think we're up to like almost a hundred characters that you <laughs> that you get to pick from um the rule set we're doing um tonight though will be uh we get a selection of money yeah yeah it, <laughs> it money. can get pretty pricey yeah <laughs> so yeah the the rule set we'll play with is we get a selection of three different characters we can pick from um, so, like, we don't get just a completely random one that we that either is um, underpowered uh, compared to some of the other ones, or like we can we can pick a character that better fits our uh, play style. I can see that Inky, you're already looking here at the alternate win conditions. I am. So, uh, the ones we have available, with uh, as you probably mentioned. We have uh, three expansions to the base game enabled. We have the city, which makes uh, makes us have an additional board uh, for the city area. Mm -hmm. um, so that's expanded, um, and there's stuff going on on that board. Then we have uh, the Reaper expansion, which means that death also roams the board. When you roll a one on uh, taking a move, you can uh, move death uh, a D6. A dice, mm -hmm. uh, regular standardized uh, number of spaces. And if death lands on a character, the character has to roll for bad stuff happening. <laughs> Do some dice with and, death. Yes. And uh, and finally, we have uh, the... What's it called? Um, the machinery expansion, something like that. Mm. We're wild, wild and west in here. Just, yeah, kind of. Uh, it is the Clockwork Kingdom. Aha. Uh -huh. So, uh, so yes, there there's <clears> going <throat> to be a lot of um, on that one. Yeah, unfortunately, it's it's we only roll d6 here. <laughs> it's boring dice. Because it's it's yeah, it, it's standard. It's standard. I mean, mm. to be fair, it's like it's. I think it's at least twenty years old. The game, like the base game. Um. Probably more like 30, um, but I'm actually not entirely sure. <laughs> yeah, this is... uh, but yes, the Clockwork Kingdom adds like a bunch of uh, constructs and stuff. And we also have like Cog, uh, the uh, the inventor, who starts out in an airship uh, on the city uh, tile and then moves around the outer, um, the outer region. Mm -hmm. There are three regions, the outer region, the middle region and the inner region. So Cock will move one space every turn around the outer region, uh, clockwise. And if you land on him, you can uh, you can do some stuff and trade. For the Sweet. Waifu expansion. Yeah, uh, we're not playing with the uh, with the Waifu expansion. That one's called Ancient Beasts, and it's a little too much, Frankie. <laughs> 
<laughs> Seriously, that's uh, that's the waifu expansion for you, huh? Which one would you call the waifu expansion? I mean... Frostmarch has the Ice Queen on it, at least. <laughs> so? So. Uh, I guess if you're really into tentacles, then uh, yeah, the beasts are awesome. Alright, should we just ready Not up? more than just tentacles. <laughs> well, I didn't really get to get into it, but yes, we have some alternate endings that we can pick from. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. So the Just alternate endings we have available because of um, because of the uh, expansions we have is like there's the default crown of command. So like when you land with the crown of command, if you roll a one two three, you don't have any effect. Or in a four five six, all other characters lose one life. Gotcha. Yeah, this is the vanilla. Yeah, this is this is the base uh, vanilla one. Then there's the second vanilla one. Called Race to the Crown. It's just the first person to get to the crown wins. Mm -hmm. One could command Chick fil A to stay open on Sunday. They could indeed. That's how powerful yes. it is. Only if they roll a 4, 5, or 6, though. Uh, the third one we can choose is the third one in the list as well. Mm -hmm. That's called Dance by Cap. And that's basically. Um, when you roll on the Grim Reaper chat, you must subtract one, and if you're on the Crown's command, you can send the Grim Reaper to visit a character in a different region. Right, in any like region. That. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we could we could pick that one and just run with. Inky, you better win. <laughs> I will do my best. I'll do my best. Yini stomped me the first time because uh, I didn't really know what I was doing, but uh, I've played a few practice mm. games on my own. We'll see. We'll see if uh, we can pull wonderful, it out. Wonderful. So yeah, yeah, Dance Macabre is basically just a, a different uh, way of doing Crown of Command. Yeah. I like it. Let's do Dance Macabre. Uh, the last two that we have failed, just so people actually know it, is we have the last two in the list. Mm hmm. You'll have to scroll down. Those are the Runic Revolution. I'm not entirely sure if we have to get to the Crown of Command to activate this one, but it basically mm -hmm. says after. When, when it gets activated, 10 rounds, and then the people with the most uh, revolution token wins. <laughs> right. So it's basically kill as many uh, constructs as you can. Yeah. The person who does the best then, wins. Yep. Yeah. And then we have the uh, second to last, which is Year of Invention. So you have to find an invention and take it to the Crown of Command. Mm. And then you choose a character to fight in Psychic Combat, and you get to make inventions if you win, and then you kill the player, and then when you kill all of them, you win. I see. Yep, I'm down for Dance Macabre. So yeah. We send our uh, we send our buddy Death to, uh, to mess with the other players instead of just doing Crown and Command stuff. To upload a few terabytes of your homework folder into them and watch them explode. Yep. Yeah. Uh... I think it. To be fair, I think it's Clockwork Golems most of it and, and stuff like that. So I'm nice. not sure they have an upload mode. Uh, but yes, I think I've just activated uh, Dance Macabre here. Um, we might as well play with a reveal landing, uh, just so we know if if something went wrong. Mm -hmm. um, we get a selection of three characters. Is that good? Sounds good. Right. Um, we need to have. Oh, no, we won't play without the Grim Reaper uh, spell timing. Us. Uh, fiddle with game speed, but I think it's fine as it is. Let's just get to it then. Get on with it. All right, here we go. Ascendant Divine. That yes. looks uh, um, quite powerful. Let's have a look here. So, the Ascendant Divine 
it begins the game with four spells face up on your character card. They're the divine gifts. They don't count as spells for the purpose of other effects and do not count against spell limits. Whenever you take a strength of craft, and then if you gain strength of craft and have four or fewer divine gifts on your character, take the top card of the spell deck and add it to the divine gifts on the character card. Once per round, you may cast one of the divine gifts as if it were a spell. <laughs> Though it does not count as a spell for the purpose of other effects, and does not count against the maximum number of spells you may cast <coughs> in a turn. And at the start of your turn, you may discard one Divine Gift to draw one spell. Nice. So this is basically just having access to more spells. Okay, uh, three, which can be very powerful. Three strength. Very much can. Three strength, three craft, four life, three fate, one gold. Mm. And no short. Man, you need got nothing but waifus. Look at this. Oh, yeah. I mean, all of these three were pretty well defined. Um, the Valkyrie. You may add one to your attack, uh, attack score during battle. That's uh, strength combat. Hmm. Um, pretty sure. Empire you may visit Hunter. the graveyard. As if, you may visit the graveyard as if you were of evil alignment. That's nice. Oh, that, yeah. Whenever a follower is killed, you may resurrect it and keep it as your follower instead of allowing it to be placed in the discard pile. You may only resurrect each follower once per turn. Each follower once per turn. Wow. Jeez. That's, That's very strong. a very, very strong class, yeah. Uh. Three strength, four craft, four life, three fate, one gold. Damn. And it does also require us to have good followers, but... The Vampire Hunter. Uh, after you encounter a space with instructions to draw one or more adventure cards, and you have drawn the number of cards, you may investigate. To do so, discard one card in on your space that is not an enemy, and draw one more card to replace it, which you must encounter. Whenever you engage an enemy in battle or psychic combat, add one to your attack roll. Ooh. Hmm. God. Whenever you visit the graveyard, you may draw one adventure card <laughs> instead of assaulting the instructions on the space. That's also pretty strong. All of these are strong. Yes, Yini, uh, Yini picked, Yini rolled well. Yeah. Uh, is there a preference in chat for which one I should play? Um, I mean, Vampire Hunters got, uh, got REZ acting up. Yeah? I mean, I'm, I'm happy to play any of them. I think the Ascendant Divine is, is going to be the strongest one just with the spell axis, but mm -hmm. yeah. Both both the Valkyrie and the Vampire Hunter has uh, has good stuff going. No. <laughs> He's really acted up. Goodness. Oh uh, yeah, I would I would say go for the Vampire Hunter. Let's do that then. Okay. Yeah, looking good. Okay, so we have the Gypsy. Can we begin the game with one spell? Whenever an event is drawn, you may use the power of foretelling and choose to be unaffected by the event, although all other characters are affected as normal. Uh huh. Whenever another character places a spell on the discard pile, you may take it and add it to your own spells if your craft allows. Whenever you discard a spell, it's placed at the bottom of the discard pile. This would have been really good if Yini went uh, Ascended uh, Ascended Divine. Ascendant Divine doesn't count as spells. Oh, that's a good point. The Chivalric Knight. You begin the game with a riding horse from the stable's deck. If you lose the riding horse, you may take one from the stable's deck for free if you visit the castle. Whenever another character in your region engages an enemy in battle, you may aid them. Move to the character's space and add your strength value to the character's attack score. If the enemy is killed, you receive one quest reward, but you must miss your next turn. You may not attack other characters in battle if their strength is less than yours, except on the crown of command space, where you must attack them as normal. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. Then we have... He's even got a horse. He's even got a horse, yeah. Then we have, uh, hey, hey, people, it's Seth. Alright, Arcane Scion. You begin the game with two spells. When you land on a character, you may take a secret look at their spells. You may then take either one spell or one magic object of your choice from that character. Holy shit. 
When any character gains craft, you may gain one spell if your craft allows. After rolling one or more dice, you may discard one spell or magic object to either add or subtract one from the result to a minimum of one. You may do this only once per roll. Wow. Um... They're all kind of interesting, and I'm very tempted to take the horse, but, um... Arcane Scion's really strong, especially stealing magic items from people. <laughs> uh, yeah. We'll, uh... We'll go with, uh, we'll go with Seth. Okay. Seems like a pretty clear-cut choice, yeah. Oh, that's... <laughs> Alright, so, since Yini can uh, see it if she's stream sniping anyways, I got Mesmerism, which uh, allows you to take a follower of your choice from any character, and Hex, place this card on any space in the outer or middle region not already occupied by a character, remains for three complete rounds, after which it's placed on the discard pile, any character landing on the Hex loses a life. So get some area denial going. He's running Monk, interesting. Monk and Scout, alright. They kind of picked boring ones. I think they just picked the first one on the list, but then... Yeah. You can you can take the time to, to look at Monk and scout yeah. see what they do if, if she wants to know. Allows you to add your starting craft to your strength during battle, which is pretty strong. If you're rolling a die when praying, you may add one to the score. You may not use any weapon or armor during battle. That's rough. Get in the mm. game with five hidden path tokens on your character card. When you draw an enemy, stranger, or place, you may place one of your hidden path tokens from your character card onto that card. If you do so, draw one extra card, add it to your space. You may choose not to encounter cards with hidden path tokens on them. Other characters cannot encounter cards with a hidden path token on them. They still count as face-up cards in that space. If a card with a hidden path token is removed from its space, return that token to your character card. Okay, this seems like a lot of potential for trolling. Could you, like, put hidden, hidden Path on a, uh... I don't know, I guess it's not items, so people can still get talismans. You need not roll the die in the chasm, crags, or forest unless you wish to. Nice. Interesting. To give, to give people an, an idea of how there's been a bit of power creep. Ignoring one of those spaces, like... The forest, the cracks, and uh, the cliffs, or whatever it is. Ignoring one of those was like an ability-worthy thing in uh, in the original game. So getting to ignore all three is. Yeah, that's pretty huge. All right, you ready to start, Yini? Get it all. Please do. And maybe I'll mm -hmm. actually go and uh, I'll go visit Cog. Yeah, sure. Makes sense. Is it Cog? Oh yeah, Wild Wild West up in here. So, I gain a trinket. What is a trinket? Geode. Is it the alchemist in the city? Oh. It's pretty good. Speaking of city, I don't, I don't actually see it on the board. Oh, yeah. Hmm. That. Yes. I guess we forgot to enable that. No, it should have been enabled. Big rip. It'll be a quick game, then. Possibly. I bought a soul stone. Mm hmm. Comes a follower. When? Oh, no, go ahead. When when this card becomes a uh, when when taken, this card becomes a follower instead of an object. How many demonic hide? When taken, this card becomes a follower instead of an object. Mm hmm. That's three to your attack roll in battle psychic combat. Wow. Okay. Is that like permanent? I'm not sure. I mean, if, if it's a follower, it can die. So. 
fair enough. Um, get hexed. The tavern is hexed. Being a good prohibitionist, making sure if you try to go for a drink, you will literally die. Um, yeah. Go to the fields. Horse and cart. Horse and cart can carry an extra eight objects for you. If you lose the horse and cart, you must leave any surplus objects of your choice in the space you're at. Oh, sweet, wonderful hoarding. Well, that's... Oh, right. Because I rolled a one, I get to move the Grim Reaper. We'll have him hang out in the graveyard. That's, uh... Seems a sensible place for the Grim Reaper to be. Mm. Don't forget the Reaper. Mm -hmm. Alright. Monk gets a uh, horny ghost woman. Let's see how he handles it. Pretty well, pretty well. Okay, yeah. Scout's got an axe, gonna make him even more of a pain in the ass to deal with. Pain in the axe. Pain in the axe, yeah. I don't particularly want to go onto the hex, so I think I'll <laughs> just go to the chap. It is illegal to go to the tavern. Hey, nice. In one life. Very nice. That. Nini becoming difficult to exterminate. I got a Clockwork Guardian. Roll one die, on an odd result you lose a turn, on an even result you take an additional turn, and the Guardian then crumbles to dust. Okay, sure. Yep. Uh, sure. Modify the roll. Increase the result. Uh huh. You feel lucky, punk? I feel uh, like a kleptomaniac. <laughs> uh, uh, a powerful, powerful rivalry was born that day. <laughs> I wonder why they gave that. Uh, I wonder why they gave that power to the little black kid. <laughs> Please don't get me banned, Yini. Cinnamon coffee, just saying. <laughs> oh, how sad for the monk. It's so sad the monk died of ligma. Uh oh. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> uh. Wow. Is this gonna be uh, instant, instant karma? All right. So. Don't worry. I'll give you a pass. Uh. So roll the dice. Actually, a thirty-three percent chance you just die. That's, um... What do you mean? Well, because, uh... It's oh, minus right, one. Oh, you got a minus yeah. one. 
Everybody's got a minus one. So yeah, just 33% chance you just die. Okay. Yeah, we'll continue. Let's do dice with death. Almost as fun as hentai with senpai. Nope, I'm happy with those rolls. We tied. Okay. Dr. Frederick, good to see you again. Yeah, it's going pretty well. Clockwork hand. Okay, Scout's amassing a lot of crap. I think I'm going to have to go steal from him. What if I do a show first? Oh. Also, I think uh, you're stealing on the works on magic optics, right? Ah, so yes, I could get his clockwork hand then. Instructed to miss a turn, you may discard this card instead. Or I could go to the graveyard. Hmm. Why did you do that? Did you think you were the Valkyrie? No. Okay. It's been a bit. Hope you had a pleasant Easter season, by the way. Yeah, yeah. It was pretty nice. I uh, was kind of saying I felt a lot better once the weather warmed up. It's kind of in a funk during winter time. Ah. An adventure grid. A hippogriff. A hungry hippogriff is hunting in this area. It will remain here until it is killed. Uh oh. Um. I never actually used that thing I stole from Yeenie, I realize. Wonderful. Alright, yeah. <clears throat> Seth killing monsters. Let's go. That's fair. I've also been in a bit of a daze. I mean, how March just slips by. Isn't it, though? And already, April has already half slipped by, too. Wood. Eh, you got wood. Oh, is he building a boat? He's building a boat. Do you really the middle region. Do you really want to go to the middle that fast? Aha! Ooh. I that's, that's a good one. Yeah. Now we have Death uh, and the Maiden. Just... All too soon, the evil summer will be upon us. It's the summer of love, Space Lord. Summer of love. Right. Yeah, in this case, getting the, have, having been the Valkyrie would have been real nice. Alright. When taking this card, it becomes an ob a follower instead of an object. So how does this uh, how does this work then? Presumably, you have to take it from someone. I see. It didn't I seem to know. work. Um. Well, you didn't take it; you stole it. <laughs> it's, it's stealing is taking. Well, not in this game, it's logic. Okay. Well. Fair enough. Alright, this one's. Hmm. Discard any number of objects you have and gain one gold for each, or visit the evil enchantress. Ah, I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky, punk. Oh no! <laughs> um, hmm. 
Well, I'm gonna lose the soul stone anyways, so... Just hope for some combat. <laughs> Since we had no winner, the summer will be brutal, indeed. Alright, there he goes. What a fool. Going to the warlock to get a quest. Deliver one fate. It's a talisman. It's not bad. It occurs to me that I probably should have just used a fate instead of giving up that soul stone, but whatever. Easy come, easy go. Soulstone didn't do anything. It's not really true. Much of a concern, right? Uh. <laughs> particularly want to fight six <laughs> strength and watch this right now. Do you want to lose a life or do you want to lose a life? Uh, I'll go here and not lose a life. Ah. Right, right, right. See, this, this is this is why I got confused. Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure if I had to encounter the space to uh, gotcha. encounter it. it. It didn't say encounter space, it says encounter. Well, you get a nice easy ghost to dunk on. Yini ain't afraid of no ghosts. Congratulations, you're my favorite female Ghostbuster. Doesn't take much. It doesn't take much, but, you know, you did it. So, I... Yeah, give me that axe. <laughs> Grats. <laughs> yep, she worked really hard at it, guys. Everyone clap for Yini. <laughs> My favorite female Ghostbuster is the faintest praise I can imagine. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Cerberus, hey! Oh, he doesn't have to encounter it. Uh -huh. Well, that's a really good sword. I, uh, I might need that sword. Let me, let me double check what that sword does. No evil character no evil may character have the sword. I'm pretty sure I'm neutral. Right? Yes. Should stay on your catch. I am, in guy. fact, That's... neutral. Oh. Yeah, you got this. You got this. No, she might not. Thank you for the jinx. She might not got this. Nope, she don't got this. Yeah, I, I really don't need you to jinx me. <laughs> See, this this is the thing Nikki does. Mm, he always yes, I, always I, get people jinxed. I use my uh I use my powers for evil. I jinx you. Yes. Make the dice fall a certain way. And this is why not everybody needs freedom of speech. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, it's the witch. Uh, witch lurks in the space for the rest of the game. If you land here, you roll and die. So basically, uh, actually, it's mostly good outcomes. Only one and two are bad. Six. Replenish fate up to your fate value. So that does nothing for me. Question is, do I be greedy? Probably not. I know how that one goes. I know how that one goes. I reroll it and it's a one, for sure. It should. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Nini's pissed that I stole from her. No. Like that you stole from me is just annoying. Mm -hmm. That you jinxed me is yes, yes, Oh, okay, that's that's the problem. Yes. Mm. 
Entwood. Entwood. Craft Harmony Wood. Oh, I see. So if you had wood in your uh, possession, it would make it even better. No, it's better. because you can craft stuff out of it. Oh, you craft I a weapon, see. It, it becomes a weapon that adds one to your crafting psychic combo. If you also have Harmony and Wood, then you can craft a weapon that adds three. I see. Okay. Um, you got anything good on you, Mr. Monk? Ooh, he has, he's got some wood. Uh, that is not a magical object. Alright. Mm. specify. Yes, yes it, it has to be a magical object. object. Alright, well, we will, uh... Get close to Yini here, what could go wrong? First good character landing here, she'll grant one of the following wishes of their choice, then vanish. One spell, gold, strength, craft, life, or fate, or teleport to any other space in this region. Okay, that's nice. Nice for them. Don't steal the man's wood, have some decency. <laughs> hey. Nothing wrong with taking wood like a pro. If there was, your mother would be in jail. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh no. Poor Mr. Monk. Wah, wah. He really is just suffering horribly of ligma here. Rolling a one would actually be a problem Wait here a because then I have it's to pick between between three different. Ooh. Well, let's hope she and doesn't roll a one. Wanna visit the witch? Wanna visit the witch more than I wanna visit the forest? So yes. Hey, very nice. Didn't do anything, but no. Oh yeah, you actually have more fate than you started with, huh? Three. <laughs> uh, I mean, I mean. Come at me. I mean. Only because I'm too much of a coward to deal with the, uh, to deal with any of this other stuff. Could have encountered the space, you know. <laughs> no, I didn't want to encounter the witch again. I think I'd rather have your ant wood. Look at me stealing wood. Stealing magic wood. Ooh, magic stream. Next three rounds, harmonies can't trigger. Interesting. Uh, best thing about this is since I'm on her space, there's nothing Yini can do to me. I probably shouldn't have uh, opened my mouth. Probably shouldn't. Wait. Hold on a second. How does that work? Did you have to, like... Wait, what? Didn't... It's supposed to give yeah, you four, I... right? It's supposed to give me four, yeah. What a ripoff. I wonder if you're supposed to, like, use the card, or... 
No, because it says when you visit the alchemist. Right. Well, shit. That ripped off. Mm -hmm. It was just pyrite. <laughs> so I could either go to the crags, or I could go to the ruins and I think encounter the cog. Yeah, we'll go there. To be fair, it's not the cog. The character's name is actually Cog, the guy on the airship. I see. Cost of another material. So do you have to, like, take the materials to a blacksmith or something? Thank you for that. So I think Blizzard makes everyone just lose their turn? Or is it just in his region? Yes. No, no, no. Um, I think Blizzard makes everyone move one space at a time. Ah, okay, okay. Well, works out for you. Trade us. Uh, could follow the cog, I suppose. Yeah, I think you can try to see if you can use the cog if you get the cog. For battle, you may dismantle this card and add three to your attack roll. I see. Oh, no, this is all the harmony stuff. Hmm. I don't know. I do not know. Oh, invent. Yep, sure enough. Convergence. All harmonies will trigger when inventions are created. Oh, interesting. Sure. <laughs> I'll take my next faith again. Triple sixes on the witch. Yeah, sure enough, you can invent if you uh, encounter the cog. Leather. We will cancel and we will invent. Choose from these materials to create a new invention. Okay. Um. I see, okay. You probably have to combine a number of items so you can combine multiple trinkets or something. I see, so yeah, you're probably right. So if I choose them all... Oh! Do up to three. You have to do three. Alright, uh, let's do that. Twinkling Wand of Thorns. Okay, what might that do? It's just a magic object. Okay. Well, that's... Just uh, uh, a weapon trinket and it's one to your craft during psychic combat. Oh, I see. Okay. Weapon plus trinket. Gotcha. One to your craft during psychic combat. I see. Alright. 
Cool. Attacked by a demon, attacked by a white, attacked by a shadow. And a homunculus, hey. No good character may have the homunculus. Go fight the clockwork soldier and the goblin. Mm. Chances are still not great. Right. I could go to the cracks, or I could reroll. Have enough faith right now. Go get another strength. Oof. Ah. <laughs> uh. When the goth GF becomes a strength beast. Goth girl abs, baby. Goth girl abs. Two bags of gold. I'm rich. Oh. To the cursed glade. Oh, all right. Yeah. Have fun with that. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Um, yeah, I got nothing. They even rolled pretty well. It's a bit of a bummer. Oh, you shitbag. Oh, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. No one steals from me. I steal from other people. Uh, what's this? Fairy. Pretty sure the f you're good aligned, so the fairy would, uh. First character one, uh, friend, one of the following wishes one spell, one gold, one strength, one craft, one pipe, one. Tell them. Yeah, we'll go here. We would like... Spell could be nice, but I'll take one... No, yes. That's that strength. Jeez. Eenie's gonna be tough to beat. You know what? I'm feeling stupid. Let's fight the wolves. So they do have advantage, so I'm just gonna have to roll well. I I will. Yeah, we're gonna draw. I could. I don't know that. Okay, the rain or the I guess that's the monk, not the scout. Right. Spare parts. And a rune stone, nice.
Hmm. <laughs> Is Yini gonna get crunk at the tavern? Go find the witch. Fair enough. No fun whatsoever. Ooh. Uh, what is the rule for my investigate? Uh, investigate. Discard one card on your space that's not an enemy. Draw one card from facing. Mm hmm. Ah, so it would just be discarding spare parts. Gotcha. Go on, go on counter it. Venom and runs. Sweet. Nice. You force them to lose one additional life. That's nasty. shouldn't get that close to the Grim Reaper. Staff of Mastery. No good character may have the Staff of Mastery. You may enslave one enemy you encounter instead of attacking it. The enemy adds its strength to yours for one battle. And then the Staff of Mastery and the enemy disintegrate to the discard pile. Very nice. So if I meet something nasty, I can uh, make it my something nasty. Temporary follower. Mm-hmm. Glimmer cloth. Oh, he's going to make a really strong trinket here. Looking power stone of luck. He drops the sword. What a neat cheat. Under your craft. So, yes, the cloaking. Cloaking power stone of luck is at once to craft during psychic combat. If you win psychic combat with the script game one spell, you may evade enemies in any region except the inner region. If you would gain a fate, get one additional fate. Man. Phantom. Go to the forest. Uh, I'll need a real roll. Unfortunately. <laughs> I mean, the phantom won't. Do I'll just anything. go. Yeah. Well, I'll, I'll go and encounter something else. Oh, I'm not allowed to encounter something. I guess I have to draw adventure cards for that to happen. Fine. Give me a two. Hmm. You know what? Oh, I'd have to give up the staff of mastery. No, never mind. Each. Yeah. Become evil. Um, I mean, it was bound to happen. It's not morally evil, it's cosmically evil. <laughs> it was bound to happen.
Kanan. Let me just fall. Yeah. Mm. Well, my objects are magic, so yeah, um... she's got she's got nothing shiny. Uh. Well, that makes me so depressed. I think I'll go get drunk. Hope you lose the time. Gamble and lose one gold. Um... Yeah, we'll accept that. Storm core. To the Warlock's Cave. Man, they really like going to the middle region. Just some material here. You could invent if you so chose. Good. Toxic acts of fire. Neat. <laughs> Don't your strength during battle. If you defeat a character and cause them to lose a life, you may discard this card and force them to lose one additional life. You may uh -huh. use this card when you engage a character in battle. Roll one die. In a six plus, they lose one life. Sweet. That's Kogas. That is Coggers. <laughs> Yeni is our little Cog champ. Yeah. yeah I Play around with the Mystic again. Yeah, give me craft. Thank you. Yeah, when it gets to uh, my turn, I'll have a 50% chance of rolling something good. Hey, hey. Uh-oh. <laughs> something tells me I am included in something good. Yes. <laughs> All your gold is fool's gold. Yeah, get wrecked, Scout. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Right. 
Uh. Uh, do I want to go anywhere near this? Um, you know what? Sure, why not? Ooh. Uh, yeah, sure. Looks of destiny. Or I could investigate and find something else. Counter it. Take it. Then we'll use it. <laughs> hmm. Oh yeah, I'm evil now. Repl replenish your fate? Yeah, I think we will. Uh, I think we will do that. Carpet. Uh, that's kind of cool. What you have to roll a one? Oh. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Scott really hates me. All right. Yeah. Um. All right. You know what? Since our, uh, since the scouts being so so kind to me, why don't you go? Why don't you go have a little roll with them? It's a risky card. Yes. 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 Come on. Come on. Ah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Misses is the next turn. That's fine. One and three. That's not a one and three. <laughs> yeah. Jumanculus in the tomb. Um, in that case, I'm just gonna go to the, the plains. Hey, ah, nice. Yeah. Yeah, all right. You know what? Acceptable. Stormcore. Yeah, give me another. Give me another one. Play it again, oh, Sam. Play it again. Leather Grimoire of Lightning. I dig it. I dig it. <laughs> All right. So it's armor. If you're defeated in psychic combat and just lost a life or a one die on a five plus, you're protected but still lost the psychic combat. Defeated in battle on a six plus, you're protected but still lost the battle. You may dismantle this card to take one additional turns after this one. Cool. Shit, it's a lion, get in the car. How embarrassing for the lion. It's full. Man. Shredded goth girl abs. I think you use like three of the four uh, uses on that. Yeah. I mean, uh, I used I used all of them except the one that uh, you use when you get it. 
McBride, and I think that was the monk. Yep. Give me cash. Wonderful. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. That's nice, he gets to do the uh, psychic combat and the physical combat separate. Alright, Monk's yeah, getting pretty swole. Not... Yeah, it's not possible to do them at the same time. Mm -hmm. Rip. Huh, really? Discarded the Sword of Light, huh? I guess his uh his thing he just created is uh technically a, a weapon, huh? Potentially. Cool. Um I'll go to the fields. A hobo goblin. Hobo couple. Hobo couple. Do you auto win? Oh, just barely not. Oh yeah, you can auto kill it. Yeah, because you get a plus one. Fire. This object is a talisman. Wow. Sure, why not? I could use a talisman. Harmonic talisman of flexibility. So talismans let you get past the uh, portal of power here. Or no, sorry, not the portal of power. The uh, the one at the very end. Valley of Fire. Yeah, you need the talisman to get through the Valley of Fire. Get to the Crown of Command. Did you plan on putting a number of materials? Craft the cards give you a copy of that card to each player equal to the number of materials they put forward. I see. If the materials are not reached, discard any materials put forward. Rip. There go your materials. That's pretty good. The horse is the best, yeah. as always. Yeah. All right. All right, Mr. Hobo Goblin, let's go. Um, all right. 
Alright, so that works like a helmet. This also works like a helmet, so fair enough. Really? Hmm, I need a fiver better to stand off. Yeah, all right. Almost. Oh, no, wait, yeah. Right, for the physical, it's a five. Or no, it's not. Psychic, it's a five I need. Ranger go. Uh, oh yeah, he's still on space the... Right, right, right. Oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Wow. It's rare to... It's rare to see the good... Uh, Oh, he's got psionic blast. <laughs> and you're starting craft your strength until yeah, the end from, of the battle. From, from the gym. Gotcha. Oh no! God damn it! You're just gonna oh, make the scout yeah. stronger. God damn it! Yeah. Oh great! Now the scout can go wherever he wants. That's what we needed. That's oh you motherfucker. But you thought you were safe. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's what I am talking about. Craft during psychic combat when in psychic combat with this equip, gain one spell. May evade enemies in any region. If you gain a fate, gain one additional fate. Or I could. No, I. Because, uh... yeah, this is just one to your craft during psychic combat. So, yes. I think I will be taking that. Thank you very much, sir. So nice when they just give it to you. You don't have to go to the trouble of stealing it. He wants to get down here badly. <laughs> dangerous contraband. Dangerous contraband. After several dangerous injuries, all inventions have been too dangerous to public. All players must discard all of their inventions, but fight against the guard with strength of four. Oh, seriously? Okay. You could investigate. Uh, yeah. You could yeah. investigate. Yeah, but I also don't want you to have uh, inventions. So. True, true, true. Yeah, I guess uh, Strength 4 is no issue for you. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just a comedy of errors. Hmm. Um, yeah, sure. So I would need a five to even tie. Fair enough.
Hmm. Yeah. Let's go ahead and take our fate back. Wonderful. I want to see the monk become evil. Let's go. I, I do not want to see the monk gain craft. Succubus! <laughs> you must also lose one craft! <laughs> oh no! And a nightmare. This has the same... Hmm. Man. Uh oh. This is Dermot. Something I like. Just uh, just that quick. Change your uh, alignment at will. Mm. Not that useful. Yeah, he actually doesn't really have that much. I'll take the talisman though. <laughs> closer than I thought it would be. That's right, yeah, you use that, I see, and then you roll. Okay. Chance that he just loses one life. Fair enough. <laughs> wow, and he just stole the wood from you. That's interesting choice. Uh-oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> oh yeah. If your rolls are a one or a That's two, you might be able to get all of your shit back. Clockwork soldier and a goblin. Uh, you know what? Mm. Not a fan. Not a fan. Ah, fine. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Oh, great. Oh, he's gonna move death. Ugh. Innovation. And fight each other in psychic combat. Uh huh. So you can ch 
challenge someone to psychic combat for a, for an invention, and the scout ruined that for everyone. Jennifer has been ignored. I'm used to it. <laughs> what? What'd you say? Sorry, I don't speak to my letters. <laughs> Yeah, I think I will just uh, not deal with you. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, let's go, Hobgoblin. And I really got to build up some strength somehow. Hmm, the portal. The mysterious portal. Does he any step through? Ah, there's nothing good on the other side. Okie dokie, well. Well, well, well. I know what I'm stealing. <laughs> That presumes you're gonna get anywhere near me. Hmm. Quite a presumption indeed. Oh no. Become evil. It's a lemur! Run! Very slowly! Hmm... Lots of lemurs. Explosive experiment. Not a bad call. No, not a bad call at all.
Animate room. Tricks in all discard piles. Eh. That, uh, that might be interesting. Yeah, that's useful. Um, hmm. All right, sure. Why not? Already have all the fate I need, so let's just pray. Hey, wonderful. Carnival. Boatman resolve allows you to cross the Storm River. Uh huh. It's Carnival. Mm hmm. Screw up this roll. Screw up this roll. Bah. Hmm. Yeah, I might have to deal with the uh, scout here pretty soon. So why is everyone able to move the Grim Reaper now? Oh, I guess he did roll a one. Riding horse. Uh... Just remember if you re-roll and roll a two or a one, you dead. Yeah. Oh, you dead. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's worth the risk. I don't... Uh, fair enough. She's awfully, uh, she's awfully blasé about this. She must not like that class very much. Priest is kind of shit, if I recall. Well, you could be Cultist Chan. You're going to have to do the voice if you pick Dark Cultist. I'm saying that right now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do the trophy. <laughs> uh, let's see. You may sell trophies you own, discard the chosen trophies, gain one gold for each. If you have no space that has one or more enemies, you may end your move there instead of moving the full distance as indicated by the die roll. Add one to your strength in battle for each animal and beast in the battle. Ah. Well, one die to receive a bonus reward. Wow. Huh. Very nice. 
fingerprints. Ah. Uh. Well, yeah, let me... Really? Why, why didn't I encounter the uh, succubus? Uh, because it has a hidden token. Hidden token. Ah, I see. X. I want to summon a succubus. Doki. Oh, fuck you. Burn a spell like that. Jeez. Good reroll. I really need you to shut up. <laughs> hey! You at least got a standoff. No, I didn't at least get a standoff. I would have won. <laughs> I mean, that's just how it works. Mm. Uh huh. Sure. Instructor and Cradle of Innovation. Hmm. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Runic Renegade, eh? The Runic Renegade's attack for each card with clockwork in its name in your inventory. Oh boy. Of course, that's what you rolled. Mm -hmm. <laughs> one die and gain that much gold, seriously. Okay. Fair enough, fair enough. Good luck, Eni. <laughs> Hope this is a really, really entertaining fight. Hope everybody does well. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, yeah, we will uh, take the cashola.
Ooh. Boner Golem, I don't know about that one. Um, yeah. Then again... Boner Golem is pretty impressive. Six, yeah, that's... So I think... Did I just fuck up horribly? Yeah, no, I still have the staff. Cool. Yep, yeah, I think you're coming with me. gonna regret that when you inevitably turn evil. That's all I'm saying. Parchment. Bone. Best treat for a best friend. Ah. More parchment. Parchment and bone is a thing, I guess. Even what even is that? Tightful scroll of strength. Shoot your craft drinks like combat. What the fuck? Okay. evil. Yeah. Thank you for telling me. Mm-hmm. Oh, my turn. Gotcha. Toxic X of Fire and a Clockwork Hand. Okay, well. I guess since Yini tried to take things from us, we'll uh, take the rest of her shit. thought I was trying to take, take things from you, then you're woefully naive. <laughs> hey, your life counts as a thing. It's not something I can take, because while you would lose it, I would not gain it. <laughs> true, true. Evaded until the end of next turn. I see. Not sure that was a very wise use of immobility, my dude. 
it so I can draw another spell. Fair enough. Okay, well, that was, uh, that was something the scout did. You don't say. <laughs> I do say, Eni, I do say. Succubus still, yes. Alright, well, let's go to the witch then. You become a toad. Toxic Axe of Fire, yeah, let's see that one strength, so... Yeah. We'll just get rid of the Clockwork Hand here. Increase result, please. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and re roll on that one. Yeah, sure. Sucks. 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 Um, that can go. Okay. not do that. Yeah, counterspell me, sure. Still screwed you out of your temporal warp. Golem, do your stuff. Oh, right, I was supposed to roll. Ah. Right. Uh, why, thank you. How generous. Uh, I will be taking that magic wand. Really, just a uh, upstanding guy. Ranger. 
foolish ranger doesn't realize I am the danger. Insightful bone of intrigue. Or he's a scout, not a ranger. So, let's move. Teleport, uh-huh. Ooh, a standoff. Nice. Honestly, probably not an undesirable outcome. Scrap heat. He's in with the chance. He's in with the chance. Okay. Probably wise to evade it, but he was in with the chance. Heads or tails. Very nice. Mm. I mean, if you think I care in the slightest about winning anymore, uh, you're a great <laughs> Yes, I know. You, you just want to destroy me. Um... No, no, I'll do that after the stream. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, don't threaten me with a good time. Uh, you know what, Mr. Scout? You you sure have a lot of nice, sure have a lot of nice things on you. You call uh, it a, th a threat. I call it a promise. Mm-hmm. Blade sharp. Cast on one of your weapons when you are about to engage in battle. That weapon adds an additional two to your strength until the end of battle. Yes, we will take that from you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. 
Okay. Let's give Yeni a better class. <laughs> I mean, this isn't gonna change anything. I hope you know. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm well aware. I'm just I'm I'm just giving you a better class, you know. <laughs> better to crump you with. Uh huh. Doing you a favor. Doing you a favor. Sure you are. Mm-hmm. Druid Warlord or a Cat Burglar? It's a kitty cat. Druids can be a huge pain in the ass. Ah, uh, they're so so. Warlord. Interesting. <laughs> uh, hopefully the cat burglar has uh, steel shit mechanics like I have. Oh. Of course it doesn't. That would be the thief. Uh, fair enough. Thief is in the base game. Now nah, we're going warlord. Okie dokie. See, uh, good old Seth has created even more warlords. As you do, as you do. Saint Joseph. Saint Joseph. Yeah. Hmm. That's cool. Yeah, gonna conscript that. <laughs> Conscript the saint. Yeah. Uh, there's a witch and there's an axe. Or I can go to the village. Uh, I might play around with the mystic a little bit. Hey. Hmm, I already have all the spells I can have, so I think what I'll do... Yeah. Give me crap. Ah, right, yeah, let's put us on even terms here, shall we? And... Let's see if we can uh, at least steal a life from you here. Nah. Okie doke. Nice. Yeah. 
I'll accept a standoff. The bitch. Ooh. In a spell. Do you have? Yeah, you got the craft for a spell. Nice. Yikes. All right, let's get inventive, shall we? On a crystal of flexibility. Alright, do we care about this? Spell limit is increased by one. Defeated in psychic combat, just lost a life, roll one die. Ah, defeated in battle, just lost a life, roll one die. On a six, you're protected. Okay. Our talisman for now. Hmm. Uh, hello, Mr. Monk. Uh oh. All oh, right, he loses one. Fair enough. So you have to roll a six to send the Reaper at someone else. Yeah. Let's see if we can actually, uh, actually get something out of the axe. Nope. Alrighty. Fair enough. Really was saving that, you know. You must fight him, but you may not roll a die for your attack roll. How's that work? You got to roll a die. Today, hyena. Chill. <laughs> no, you chill. How about maybe you chill? Oh. Mm. That is interesting. I... Well, take the chance. Good 
focus my axe. Hmm. Yeah. Groovy. Oh yeah, I get to take a material. That's nice. Fancy. Wow. I'll take armor and I'll conscript the prince. <laughs> conscript the prince. Uh, what's here? Oh, it's a Durgan. Um. Yeah, I don't think I want to deal with the Durgan. Black Unicorn. If you defeat the Black Unicorn in Psychic Combat, you may keep it as a follower instead of a trophy. While the Black Unicorn is your follower, add one to your strength and one to your craft. It will remain here until it's defeated. Nice. Alright, well. Dice don't fail me now. The dice have failed me now. Get this is worth a reroll. Ah. I thought he was looking for trouble. <laughs> Take on the dragon. Kill it. Great idea. I could. <laughs> you could. It is something you could do. And I'll wait to take on the dragon and see if I can get a little more strength first. That seems like a good idea. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's a good way to get more strength. Yeah, we'll just take that as a regular follow on. Mm -hmm. That's just silly. Leper or the crags? Uh, you know what? I Should didn't like the take spell. On the track now? Yeah, okay. Nice. Summon bear. So far. Storm River is if you're using a raft, then the carnival travels on. Roll a die and move the carnival that many spaces clockwise around the board. Cool. Um. You know what? I'll. I'll roll the dice. I used to roll the dice. Feel the fear in my bee's eyes. Alright. Three gold, five points of craft trophies, deliver one spell. Eh. 
Eh, let's go for that. <laughs> beat his ass! <laughs> beat it at beat his ass, father. Let's go. You love to see it. Couldn't have happened to a nicer scout. Fun in the crags, buddy. Roll a one. Alright, watch me fight these dragons. I believe in you. What? The dragons not count as monsters? A load of hoopla. That seems incorrect. Thinking wrong. Rosti, you have uh. a horse and cart, mule, riding horse, a war horse. They must be discarded along with this cart. Motherfucker. I think you ditched your horse and cart, so. Mm hmm. Yeah, but you have a war horse. All right, so what do we have here? We have a white and the pool of life. You know what, I will, uh, I'm feeling some ranch. Let's go to the Hidden Valley. Familiar. Familiar will become your follower if you lose one life. Add two to your craft. Whenever you draw a spell that you do not wish to keep, you may discard and draw another one to replace it, which you must keep. Let's go, yes. If I stand off, fuck. If I stand off, I don't get to do the rest of the uh, stuff, huh? I think my turn immediately ends. Uh, yeah. Summon bear sounds fun, but uh, yeah, we will uh, go ahead and increase the result there. Oh, fuck, right. Thanks for the talisman, buddy! Thanks for the talisman! Six or a three would be good. Four. Um. What works spell crafter? This card of three spells. If you do take any spell you wish from the spell deck. Now I don't have any spells though, so. Hey, I gain a spell. Fireball. Fireball! Fireball! Roll one die on edge craft if the total is half and the person creature strength that is killed. That's pretty good. <laughs> Not really that useful against the, uh, the dragon. Have to have to remember it's limited to a maximum of seven. Mm hmm. Alright. 
to Cerberus. Uh, let me choose okay. mine first. Play Cerberus on the Portal of Power. Play this may not cross up to the Plane of Peril while Cerberus is on the Portal of Power. Cerberus cannot be evaded. You must choose whether to attack Cerberus using Strength or Craft. Interesting. Can't encounter it, though. Oh, you can't encounter it? What? You can't encounter it. Oh. God, the scout's annoying. Yep, sure enough. Good eye. Alright, well. Fine then, and just go to the oasis. Paper doll. Paper doll is, doll is the target of a spell. Discard it. Okay. That's a thing, I guess. Confirm the thing. Yeah, let's go, Sentinel. He's probably gonna reroll. Yeah, fuck. You needed to roll better than that, buddy. You really needed to roll better than that. you hadn't done that. I set. Oh, I, I wanted the familiar. I think everybody would want the familiar. <laughs> To the leper, which I don't want, or I could go to the <laughs> city, which I also don't really care about. Um, I believe in you to make the correct decision. How terrible is the leper? It's real bad, right? Um, <laughs> wow! Oh no! Wow! Okay, well. Wow! Well. Wow! 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 Look at that! Amazing. Sometimes the game feels like it's cheating. Sometimes, yeah. Creatures you fight here add two to their attack rolls. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's go to the woods. A guide. Thank you. I need to go slash some peeps up. Paper dragon, wow. Paper dragon. Hmm. Okay, well that's nasty. Very fortunate that the scout rolled exactly what he needed. Mm-hmm. To, to heal his life, oh, yeah. yeah. 
Ooh. I could do the Durgan. I am doing the Durgan. Let's go. Need a five plus. Of course. Mm. Excellent roll. I would like to trade the dragon for strength. You need Duncan on the Durgan. What does the tomb do? Oh yeah, attacked by a demon, which ten, attacked by a white. Tomb does nothing. Gain <laughs> three gold or gain a talisman. Yeah, the tomb sucks. It's either the that tomb or... does nothing. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, the tomb does nothing. I'm still not used to the scout stuff. of taxation. Wonderful. Yeah, it's pretty uh, convenient for the scout, I must say. Three. I would have liked a two, but sure, I can deal with a three. A G out. Geodude. Hmm. You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna use that card. Secret to Tiger. Oh no. Some taxation. If any player would spend gold, they must spend one additional gold. Fun times. Yay. Yay. Yeah, the monk just gets a talisman for nothing. Try nice. The pixie. I hit a a one, a four, a five, or a six. Sure can. Not the one I would have preferred. Kill the witch. 
Alright. So that, that paper dragon is absurd. It's uh, nine strength. Yeah. Either that or the chasm. Ooh. And none of these are, uh, none of these are very good. You could decrease and go fight the monk. I could do that, yeah. And by fight, I mean steal from. What? Yep, I, uh, think I uh, will be taking that. Thank you. spells. Yeah. Dryad. Hmm. Good to have. I would want a three, six, three or a six, preferably. Okay. It's not the one I prefer to. Drink your sorrows away. Now I'll or go, go play find something in the woods. Ooh, it's so shiny. It cannot be dismantled. Be sold for four gold and spell them as increased by one. Okay, not bad. So so. So so. Alright, we're gonna take a big risk and go to the runes. Destroy magic. I really like that, uh, I really like that drawing. Just the jester being a gigantic troll. Okay, yeah, give up your holy lance, by all means. Watch you stand on my space. <laughs> At least he's uh, not being a bastard to you. Problem is, I can't reach him from here. True.
Just leave the talisman there. Maybe some poor unfortunate soul will need it. Uh, Alright, let's try and make you lose a life here. Nothing I can do to get out of this one. Just gotta roll like a legend. Oh! Um, yeah. How about you, uh... Guess you should hustle as hard as you hate, huh? Go fight this Lemure. Or not. Oh, I guess it. Not allowed to because there's a fucking token on it. God, that's annoying. Yeah. Um, could just have nothing. I. Terrible idea, but I think I will risk the runes again. Also reduced. Ooh, what is that? Idea. Your attack rolls are reduced by one to a minimum of one. I see. When attacking against another character, you may force them to take the jester instead of your normal reward. <laughs> Brutal. The pathfinder. Hmm. Seems pretty good. Seems good enough. The only thing I can hope is that the uh, scout doesn't move onto my space again. Hmm. Having said that, he probably will. Probably, yes. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Right. We'll just have a whole lot of nothing in the hills. Back to, back to try again, are we? Be fair, he has the statistical advantage. It's true. Five or better, let's go. Nope. Hey, hey. Suppose that is also an option. Hey, hey, yes, thank God the scout's gone. Celestial. That's the ranger. 
Scott could have become a uh, Scott could have become a rain cat. But he chose not to. I'll give you some time to look at the uh, celestial if you want to. Yeah, I probably should. All right. You're always good. If any effect would change your alignment to neutral, ignore it. If any effect would change your alignment to evil, ignore it and lose one life. Craft value is equal to your current fate. After you roll the die to pray, you may ignore the result and replenish one fate instead. Whenever you gain one or more lives, you may gain one fate. Whenever you heal one or more lives, you may replenish one fate. When you attack an evil or neutral character, you may choose to make the attack psychic combat. You may not do this when you are attacked by another character. If you win, you must take one fate from the loser instead of the normal reward. Eh, it doesn't seem great. Well... Yeah, it's, it's... It could be alright. Wonky, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's a very different place, well, though. Very he has four well, fates, since I get so. to teleport in here... That means four craft. Uh, otherwise, it's only one craft. But since I guess I, I get to teleport to anywhere I want, I'll just go to the uh, the spot where the scout died. Yeah, yeah. That's, um, out of this base. That's a uh, good idea. What would spellcraft on? Yeah, that's nice. Also, a spell. Get the spell steed. I'd run to. I'd want to that I roll after moving. Hmm. Sure. Scroll of inner strength. Insightful scroll of strength. Whatever. I'll take it. The maiden. I'll take her. Flying carpet. Take it. Carrying too much shit. Um, I won't need the axe. So I won't need the axe. Riding horse. I'll take it. The amateur inventor. Material. If you try to know if you got one of your inventions to craft a new card from the top three materials of the material stack. Mm hmm. Uh. Yeah, kind of interesting. I script as a follow up. Uh, give the amateur adventure a material of your choice in order to discard one of your inventions. I have a pretty shit invention, so yeah. <laughs> well, take you as, uh, take you as a regular fellow like it. Yes. Crown will take it. Pixie, uh, you get conscripted. Prince, you get conscripted. Uh, I'm not sure inventor. So at the start of my turn. Okay. Sure. Spare part hunter. Well, companion has a nose for shiny objects. Whenever you exchange any spare parts card, you may choose to take another material. Sure. All right. Let's try again against this uh, saber tooth. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, he won't be showing up in the next Ice Age sequel. Hey, I got a life! I finally got a life! They've been telling me to do it for years. I finally did it. Thanks. Ah. Right. Life and full of fortune, okay. No, <laughs> that sucks.
Oh, nice teeth here. Yeah? Both sex. Uh... Darkness. Evil darkness. Thank you. I think I'm the only one who doesn't have to miss a turn. Are you evil? Sure am. Oh, okay. Well, then you did us both a favor. Yep, sure enough. Oh, right, right, the scout is gone, so I have to actually encounter this. Fair enough. Yeah, sure, we'll deal with the shadow. Not an issue. Mm hmm. Alright, come on, give me a two. Give me a two. That's not a two. become a problem, aren't you? <laughs> what do you mean, going to? <laughs> uh, how many have you conscripted? It's a lot. Four? Four? Okay, yeah. You're you're gonna be a problem. I'm just thinking about which items I could actually do with that. Um... Really use is something that increased my carrying capacity. Um. The horse filcher stole mine. Ooh. Giant. Yeah, well, I'll find a giant. He's neither jolly nor green. I picked up a book from, uh, from what's his face. Uh, couldn't tell you. Enough. Take me to the woods. Demigod. Demigod grants you the spell of your choice if your craft allows. Take one of your choice, then mix together a spell deck, spell discard pile, and shovel them. Demigod then vanishes to the discard pile. Okay, that's pretty cool. What to do? What to do indeed. Mm, that's a pretty good one.
Man, that's that's a lot of spells. Um, but I think yes. Demon, let's go. Yeah. He actually, still has a chance, which is disturbing. Yeah. Not the Nosica. Does that demon stay out? No. No, no, no. It's it's like uh, if you encounter something in the cracks or whatever. Sure. In the board game, it wouldn't have a card or anything. Fair enough. That's why. Um, that's why they have a full art instead of like a card with text. Oh, look, and go to the city. No. Does y'all uh, have a hat? First, <laughs> follow. Who can script her? Can't, would that screw you over? No. No. <laughs> she loses all abilities. She just loses and, uh, all abilities. Becomes okay. uh, at one strength. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll encounter the space. I'll go visit the alchemist. Playing a board game? At, uh, we sure are, girly gamer. Good to see you. Yeah, we're playing some yep. talisman uh, tonight. An old but a goodie. Shiny rod. Oh. Okay. So... Should give me money. But last time it didn't, so I think you need to discard it. You may discard this to gain four gold. Not alchemize, discard it. Right, right. The problem is, it's not uh, an ability I have with with any of my cards. Mm, okay. Like in, in the second type, it's uh, second tap. It's not there. Um, uh, all right. Well, in interested to see if it works. I mean, if not, it's it's not like it does anything. It gives me one spell limit increase, and yeah, that's that's all it does. So. Hey, it works. Ah, yes. Nice. Cash money. Hello, Kelly. Nice to see ya. Alright. Oh, the Cerberus is out now. Yeah, I think I'll deal with the Cerberus. Or try to, at least. Oh, well, that's that's a problem. <laughs> is it gonna make me... Okay. I think you get to choose. I, th I, I do get to choose. Uh, yeah, there's not much I can do here, unfortunately. Just hope I roll well. I do not. Oh, did you, uh, did you, did you not pick up Psionic Blast or whatever? No, I decided to be far more annoying. Let's see. My condolences. Thank you. <laughs> Wonderful, okay. yes. Yeah, unfortunately he doesn't lose a life because he's got a talisman, but whatever. Well, oh dear. <laughs> Alright, so I could use the horse here. I don't know if I need it. 
Mm. So I'll probably I'll probably roll normally, and if I roll a two or a six, I'll be in the money. Actually, I want two or a six, so I'll be in the money. Hey. Uh, I will try to encounter the space. Encounter the mercenary. I'll conscript him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Get paid? No. No. Uh, Actually, you know what? Let's uh, let's be annoying. Come on, turn into a toad. Turn into a toad. Turn into a toad. Oh well. In one strength. Wop wop. That is. Uh, uh, not as intended. Not as intended. Oh, Cerberus is back here. Okay. Well, since Cerberus is what I wanted to deal with. Yeah, fight with craft here. Oh, do I not have... Hmm. Okay, I thought I... Oh, right, the bastard monk stole it from me. Okay, well. We will battle with honor. But not that much honor. Just your might. Mm-hmm. Oh, I can trade you for str Oh, right, because it is. Yeah, well, I'll take strength then. Interesting. Because it could be strength or craft. I can get either. Yeah. Gotta go, sadly. Doc's the point. Good luck. Uh, yeah. Thanks for dropping in, girly. Well, I appreciate take it. Take care, girly. Hope everything's go. Every Hope everything goes well. I've been drinking that much. <laughs> <laughs> that much. Mm -hmm. I'm like two thirds through 2.75 uh, mm -hmm. beverages. Uh, rolling a one, that's terrible because that means I only have a one in three chance of getting what I want. Boo. Five is not what I want. Good. Go fight bears in the hills. <laughs> That's always a uh, always a thing you can do. Going on. Put a bear. on some armor. Going on a bear hunt. Not that you need it. No. Ugh, man, that's a. Some That's a problem. Eni is becoming a problem. Mm. The problem is me. Mm -hmm. Just be happy I don't have the war horse anymore. be taking my uh what yeah what what spells do you have actually um custom character any time eventually the character must take eh, it's all right i think i will be taking my stone back thank you very much So, just want to say... Let's do it! 
I wouldn't have done this if you weren't becoming such a problem. Yeah, I'm sure you would. Oh no, I lose the mercenary. Fair enough. Yeah, let's go Lava Golem. Scorch him. Oh. Give me a one, a two, or a six. Three. Boo. Exactly what we didn't want to happen. There's a leper on the graveyard. Um, or I could go to the cracks. Take a chance with the cracks. Don't you have a guide? Oh, you can script them. No. Never mind. <laughs> Why would I don't want a guide. So you don't get lost in the crags? I don't plan to go on the cracks. Fair enough. I mean, I guess technically, technically I could have uh, gotten out of it. Uh, but I feel like I would much rather uh, go slam up the celestial uh, <laughs> steel, uh, steel item and a follow up. <laughs> Bludgeoning angels. Yes, I absolutely should have had um, that one book that the scout had. The one that gave plus two strength, plus one crafter, or whatever. Mm -hmm. That one's just disappeared. Oh, you know, the one he stole from me, I'm pretty sure uh, he destroyed it. <laughs> Cheap Golem. Adds one to its attack roll for each object in the discard pile. That's... that's not good. What is, what is his attack roll gonna look like? Oh, plus 22! <laughs> um, uh, apparently I have the option to evade it for some reason. I'm I'm taking that. Yeah, even I'm not uh, likely to go for that one. Mm -hmm. Plus twenty-two. Uh, I forget what a ten gives you at the temple. Something good. Oh, it gives you a talisman. Okay. Uh, do I have Lucky a talisman? You. Uh, sure. I don't want it that bad. Eh, uh -huh. get dehydrated, idiot. Thanks All for that. characters in this region. Oh, you got out of the bag. I... <laughs> now I have no interest in... Now uh... I have nearly no interest in finding the Celestia. Runic Revolutionary, oh.
need anything out here anymore. There are no more followers that I can easily grab, so uh, let me go grab some followers in the inner, inner ring. Would be a shame if you died of Ligma. Heyo. Eleven strength, jeez. Crazy. Concealed, Concealed couch. Oh. Ah. That's pretty good. So let me let me see here. Um I'll use this concealed pouch to hide my uh is Solomon's crown. Probably, yeah. yeah. I'll hide my Solomon's crown. Probably have just uh, used the normal roll. But nine. Oh, what's the desert? I don't particularly want to go to the desert. <laughs> Nothing good happens there. It is a silly place. True, but I could encounter the monk. And the monk has followers. <laughs> I also go to the moons. Let me go fight the monk. Wow, fair fight. Fortunately. Puppet. But I guess that's the lesser of the many evils it could have been. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I will uh, I will take a spell for sure. What to do? 
Or I can go to the castle. Don't think there's any reason ah. for you to yeah do the castle. I'll use speed. Build the uh, castle in the tomb, huh? Yes. Put put walk out of the inner region too. That's an option. True. I think I'll go to the fields then. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's that's impressive. It is. Mm. Same strength as its opponent. So, um, <laughs> I mean, the question is: Is it before or after I uh, I get my followers? Guess we'll find out. I think it's without, because it's a modifier my followers. Nope. No? It's the same. Hey. It's just a stupid amount of strength. I only have eight. The monk has mm. nine. Uh, speaking of the monk, you got anything good for me to steal? You do have spells. Oh, and a flying carpet. That's right. Yeah. What do you steal for me? Mm hmm. All right. Took well. from me, I guess. I think I will. Uh... Think I will. Well, let's see what kind of spells you have. All oh, right, you have dominate and force smelled, which you know could come in handy. Good, it could. Yeah, you know what? I'll, uh... Come on, six. <laughs> you know what? Uh, let's let's have some fun with the celestial, shall we? <laughs> of course, <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Oh yeah, he's got decent amounts of craft. Fair enough. <sighs> Celestial better not become hammer. a problem too. What? You don't like that you're the only one that is a problem? <laughs> Rather, you like you don't like not being the only one. Exactly. Uh, yes.
Oh look, I go to the Warlock's key. Mm -hmm. Feels like that isn't random, that feels like that just... Yeah, it sends you there a lot, doesn't it? Uh, level two gold. Yep. Three. Uh. Does the monk have anything else fun to steal? It doesn't really look like it. We'll leave him alone for the time being. Clockwork Defender. If you lose a battle, that you may discard the Clockwork Defender that becomes the standoff instead. Okay, yeah. Yep, yeah, that'll probably be useful at some point. Coming problems, I don't like it. Eight. There's an eight. Isn't that great? Mm hmm. make things unpleasant for you. Oh, I mean, it's gonna relieve you of a uh, useless follow-up, but if you want to, uh, if you want to actually do something annoying about it, sure. <laughs> Okay, well, in that case, um, I'll take your one. And... I'll take your Clockwork Defender. Mm-hmm. are your objects. Uh, yeah? I see. I see. Well, that's very nice. I'll be mm -hmm. sure to take that next time. Implying there will be a next time. Character, your choice to lose two points of strength of craft or one of each. Rod is then discarded. Ah, wonderful. Well then, let's, uh... Ooh, you know what? Oh, I only have one gold. Damn it. Well, I... 
right, say so let's go ahead and use that then. Not on me. Oh no! Mm-hmm. <laughs> Damn it. Got rid of the jester. Fun with the trash heap golem. <laughs> uh, did we forget that was there? Forgot it was turned into in the pile. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> like I have to care. It's a shame you decided to use it on me. Oh, we'll deal with the monk. We'll deal with the monk. How well you? Powers down, thank you very much. <laughs> so conscript one of your followers, I'll take your uh, I'll take your spare part under. And uh you know what? Um here. Gonna And there. Use my conceal. No, nothing here. Um. Then what? What is? What is your problem? What is your problem? I don't know if you can undo it. Oh, fair enough. 
I mean, the, the thing is, I can use the object, which means I must be able to do something. Mm -hmm. Remove the Solomon's crown. Carrying too much. It's fine. We will throw. Now we will use the pouch. Um, Could you hurry this up so I can kill you? Sure. Alright. Uh, yeah, we'll do. We'll do. Yeah, I gotta love it. Ah. Oh, some horses. We'll go out here by the sentinel. And while I'm here, I'm going to uh, use my pouch again and I'll sing. And I'll use my pouch again and I'll hide my magic wand. Moraitis. Steal all my gold. Okay, sure. I'll be right back. Okay. Don't be surprised if you come back and you're dead. Sure, sure, sure. We can deal with the shadow, no problem. Get to wait for Yeni. Hmm. <laughs> uh, she gets so petty. She gets so petty. I feel like uh, Grim Reaper maybe wasn't the play. I don't know if we're gonna well we'll see we'll see how the monk does if 
the monk gets to the center, the game might end pretty quick, but uh, I was about to say, I don't know that we're going to necessarily finish this tonight. Especially if uni takes forever in the bathroom. You know, just taking her sweet ass time. Our board game's wonderful. Just never known anything more efficient at making you hate each other. Sorry about the wait. Uh huh. Yeah. How about you roll the dice? Sit down first, you know. Mm, eh, you don't need to sit down to click a click a button. I'm sitting down to put on my headphones. So. The princess. The shrine. We get scrap it. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see. War. War never changes. Conscript everybody. Mm-hmm. Uh, or I can go to the runes. Yeah, let's go to the runes. Arc Sail Pilot. Pay one gold for the Arc Sail Pilot to take to any other available space on the board outside of the inner region. Arc Sail Pilot will also move to that space. Nah. Nah. Alright, come on. Roll well, Death. Roll well. Let's see those double sixes. Demon. Yeah. Uh, you have fun with that. I'd rather not. Psionic Blast. <laughs> Magician. Hmm. Which means any or all strength points you have, except those derived from objects or followers into craft points, or vice versa. Whether or not you use this power, the magician then vanishes. It's interesting, I guess. Possible. It's very interesting. I don't think I have a lot of, like, the only, uh, points in, I think I only have, like, points in craft from, uh, from items, uh, and possibly followers. Hmm. Sure. I'll encounter the magician. I'll turn on, see, I can't even convert craft to strength. I'll convert strength to craft. Hmm. And then I'll go grab some more strength. 
I mean, I've got psionic blast. True. Ah. Game totally cheap. So, uh, now when are you gonna take care of the monk? Just you wait and see. I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm landing on my space, battling my character. Powers then, I guess. Yeah, that was not a uh, not a good call on his part. Usually, the computer isn't that stupid. Let's see, what is this power stone? Reconnect power stone, darkness. I want to craft during psychic combat. If you win a psychic combat, this is good. One spell. Reuse this card when you engage a character in battle. Add two strength during combat. I'll take that one, please. And I'll also take your riding horse. <laughs> Yeah, that was, um, that was pretty mm -hmm. not well thought out. Yeah. Scripting some horses. Cool. Um. Uh, go fight some little Lemures. Counter spell. Well, not the spell. Misdirection. Mm hmm. Take that trash heap golem. Groovy. I'm not sure if you get to use the special either. I'll be excited to see. Certainly will be interesting. I don't know, are you actually going to be able to do anything to the monk? Yes. Just gotta roll. When are you going to be able to Probably when he gets to the crown. 
I'm not sure I want him to have that chance. No. So that's the beauty of this ending. I don't think getting to the crown necessarily means much. I mean, it is an getting advantage. To the crown but... means, getting to the crown means you get to sick, sick death on people. Mm-hmm. It's a pretty big advantage. If you say so. That's Still have the psychic crystal, but still, uh, nah. Uh, um, go now in front of the space. Space, the auction house. You lift up card of the material, they start with you. Each player may. Place a bit equal to the amount of gold that they own, but it's also higher than the last bit they placed. Mm -hmm. It continues until each player won't bid any higher. The player that bids the highest takes the material and spends the equal amount of the bid. No one bids the auction closes down. Pretty lame. Hmm, what? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yep. Super, super cool card. Super. Lane. Super. Lane. By the time we get to your turn, I need to know if you're gonna be able to do anything. Statistically, yes. Okay. Before the start of the monk's turn, I need to know if you're able to do anything. I'm always able to do something. So I can't use that for anything. Why would I help you? Uh, because the monk might win otherwise. That's a pretty good reason. Not really. Okay. Guess I won't do anything to the monk either then. Mm-hmm. You do whatever you like. Oh, I'm gonna nook you so hard later. <laughs> hmm? What? It's a local thing, you wouldn't understand. Mm -hmm. Buy anything? Market day! <laughs> to talisman. Um. Two craft on strength. Hmm. 
So are you actually able to do anything to the monk? Yes. Um, what's on the oasis? Uh, it's gold. Alright, sure. You didn't do anything. Thanks. Have fun. You didn't tell me anything. <laughs> Delightful. I mean, I could, I could have misdirected the monk so he'd have to take another lap, but mm -hmm. you're an idiot who doesn't say anything. <laughs> oh, I fully intend to kill the monk. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Actually, where was where was all of your shit? All of my shit. Mm hmm. Why the fuck would you my, want my shit? Eh, there's some decent stuff. You can stuff. eat shit. <laughs> all right, let's see if the trash heap golem works. Nope, doesn't look like it. Told you. Glad I didn't attack her with it. Hope the monk targets you next. I hope he does. <laughs> Good for him. can't target the monk. Okay, so yeah, we're fucked. Oh, really? Fun. Really? Alright. Yes. <laughs> Who would have thunk? I mean, it's not like I told you if you could do anything to the monk, I would like you to tell me. I thought you could target the monk. Fair enough. No. Well, you know, what matters is that Yini didn't win. I think we're all, we're not losing, we're, we're losing sight of what matters here, which is that Yini did not win. Uh, no, no, no. You thought you could win this. This is an inky owl. Mm, never said I could win this. I said I could do something to the monk. It turned out that uh, it was uh, let the monk win, apparently. Yeah, that's an inky owl. Mm-hmm. This party's getting crazy. Um, sure. Whoa, no, no, no. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Shit about the orb of knowledge. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I can't believe I fucked that up. Okay. Fair enough. Sack the sack. Miser Dragon. Steel making making the monk's job job a little easier. Ah. Right. Baby oh baby oh baby. Mm, subtract your craft from the total and move directly to Alright. Rude? What? I had a zero. You had a one. I didn't. I had eight and I subtracted one. My craft is... Oh, right, right, because the unicorn's dead. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. Groovy. I think it would be funner if you could send uh, the Grim Reaper back at the uh, person at the Crown of Command. much? Nope. Fair enough. <laughs> AI wins! But you know what this means? Yeeny loses. So we're doing better than last time, at least. I got third place, Yeeny got fourth, so uh, consider that a victory. There is no third and fourth place. There is only winners and losers. <laughs> You're still as much of a loser as always. Uh-huh. Hey, I got PvP Master. Got Revenge. Took your revenge on another character. Yeah. Killed with the Grim Reaper? I did indeed. Hey. Yes. Grab that runestone. All right. Well, that it truly is the magic of board games, isn't it? Uh, you yes. go in, you go in the best of friends, and you, you leave hating each other's guts. Oh, no, no, no. I still love you. I still love you. <laughs> still love you. I, I, uh -huh. think, I just think you're an idiot. Uh-huh. 
Hey, if if I could send the Grim Reaper back at the monk, I was in very, very good shape. Yes, if if the rules were different, you could have done something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the rules were not uh, different. You know, like like Rumsfeld said, there are known unknowns and there are unknown unknowns. That was a that was an unknown unknown. It should have been a known unknown, but it was an unknown unknown. And now it's a known known. So uh, you know, progress is being made. Sure, mm -hmm. we'll pretend that's true. Progress is being made every day, Eni. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh... You're such a twat. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Hey. I don't want to hear that from fourth place. A lot of loss. Yeah, I don't want to hear that from the biggest loser. I don't want to hear that from the guy who lost because he couldn't read. I... There was nothing in the ending about not being able to send the Grim Reaper back. Just that you get to Obviously, send the Grim yeah. Reaper every, uh, every turn. That's all Obviously. I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. You come at... No, 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 no. You come at the Reaper. Mm -hmm. Which means the Reaper can't go against you. <laughs> Is that obvious? Uh, I don't think it's uh, I don't think it's that obvious. Well, clearly it was for me, and clearly it wasn't for you. Uh huh. So that's why I I offered to uh to take the monk on another trek around the inner circle, but um you were too eager to let. Me. Yeah, don't fear the Reaper. That's right. That's right. Correct. Absolutely uh, correct. But also, the monk tagged the bigger, the bigger threat first. And that is why you are the biggest loser. Huh? Unless you're in Mass Effect. Unless you're in Mass Effect. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, if you really uh, were interested in winning, you would have done that, uh, regardless of what I was saying. I mean, I tried to, but you ended your turn before I could actually do anything. And it didn't compute uh, that I actually activated my misdirection before I got to, uh, before the monk moved. Sucks to suck. Yeah, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs> well then this was uh this was scintillating um <laughs> so yeah. i'm gonna be back tomorrow playing some uh some deus ex mankind divided um you need do you uh do you know what you're doing this week yet do you have anything scheduled or uh, anything coming up I know what I'm doing Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, okay. Um, but not particularly otherwise. Um, Fair enough. I'd be happy if, if people told me what they want. Mm. Uh, because otherwise, I may or may not stream. <laughs> mm. Fair enough. So, yeah. Alrighty. Well then, I think that's uh, going to do it for me tonight. So thank you all for, so much for coming yes, out. Yes. Uh, Yini, thank you, question mark, for uh, joining me tonight. Oh, it, it's been a pleasure playing games with you. I, I just I just wish you could read a little better. <laughs> uh, I wish I wish you didn't. Uh, I wish you weren't so damn slow with the, uh, with the spells, you know. Really seems like a skill issue more than anything. No, it's a connection issue. Uh-huh. I You're mean, you didn't tell me when you were ending your turn. You told me you could do something, but you didn't tell me when. Yini, you're, you're, you, you were did. literally, you were hosting the game, Yini. There's no connection. Yes, there is a connection. <laughs> I, I have to know 
when you're ending your turn. <laughs> uh, all right. Sucks to suck. I'm connected, sucks I'm to suck. Sucks to suck. You do. Suck. You do. No, you do. No, you. I'm rubber, you're glue. I'm not the one. No, you. I'm not the one who made the mock win. Uh, I don't know about that. Well, I do. And I wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if you hadn't stolen my shinies, I would have gone in earlier. To the, uh, to the central. Sure. Sure. Mm-hmm. Maybe if you hadn't stolen my shinies, I wouldn't have stolen your shinies. Mm-hmm. Just saying. Anyways, that's going to do it for me tonight. Uh, thank y'all for coming out, um, and I'll catch you again tomorrow. So until next time, I'm Iki. I bid you wallate. Bye, you know. Catch you all later. All that good stuff. I need to... Uh, I need to correct the uh, hyena, I think, so we'll, uh, uh, we'll catch you later. Sure. Bye! Bye, you know.